Hey, what is going on, all my fellow geeks, geekettes, nerds, comic book bookers, video game players, and action figure collectors all around the world? This is the Proud Nerd, and I am back in a brand new unboxing video for you guys. Got myself a package in the mail today, and I want to open it for you. The buddy of mine that sent this to me uh, specifically asked me to open it on camera for him, and I said, okay, why not? But of course, if you're going to do an unboxing, you need a box and a knife. Oh, what is it? <gasps> I knew it! I knew it! I had a feeling this is the figure he was going to be sending to me. He sent me his custom Return of the Jedi Boba Fett. Dang, that is awesome. Man, he did some really good work on this. Look at that. It's a custom Boba Fett. Look how good that paint work is. That is pretty dang good. That is like really good. He's got his jetpack and his blaster. Man, he did really good work on this. Look at that jetpack. That's as screen accurate as it can get right there. Man, this is, this is not bad one bit. I'm digging him. Digging him a lot. Another Boba Fett for the collection. And wouldn't you know it, I just happen to have my Empire Strikes Back Boba Fett. <laughs> this is so awesome! I got two Boba Fetts now! One from Return of the Jedi and one from Empire Strikes Back. That is awesome! Man, I love him. Put Empire Strikes Back Boba Fett there. Man, I love him. I'm digging him. Digging him a lot. Oh, antenna is bent. Man, dude, you did a really good job on this figure. The, the paint and the color, it's all perfect. It's as screen accurate as it can get. Not bad. The gaunt the color of the gauntlets are, from what I can tell, pretty accurate. The color of his belt looks pretty accurate. From what I can tell, this is pretty screen accurate. I'm no expert, but what do you guys think? Try to... Does that look pretty screen accurate? He doesn't have his cape, but I don't care. That jetpack looks real... I'm really impressed with the jetpack. That is 100% screen accurate. Yeah, it looks like a custom because it's supposed to. This is beautiful, man. This is gorgeous. This is... Wow. Yeah. 
and he get, he got the the green on the helmet perfect. He got it down perfectly. Let me see the differences. Yep, there's definitely differences in the greens in these. Bro, you definitely did your research. The green matches perfectly. This is just so freaking awesome! This is my very first custom. Not... Of course, I didn't do it. My buddy did. So, to be more accurate, this is my very first custom that's ever been sent to me. And you know what? I love him. I love him. I'm digging him so much. Oh, he left the feet unpainted because this was originally the Walgreens exclusive Boba Fett. Yeah, you can see that the boots are still pretty white, but it doesn't bother me because the rest of the figure looks so good. Dang. I'm going to use them for a lot of my pictures. That is so freaking awesome. And I love that you can move the legs around. Well, you can for this Boba Fett. You just have to move the pouches out of the way, but... You don't have to do that for this one because he cut the pouches off, which was a smart move. This guy will be used for outside figure photography. Outside shots. Definitely. Oh my gosh, I am digging him so much. He is so damn cool. I love him. Bro. Thank you. Oh, oh, right. Duh, it was the Walgreens ex exclusive. There was no Mandalorian sign right there. Dude, seriously, thank you so much for this custom. He is really cool. If Hasbro ever makes an official Return of the Jedi Boba Fett figure, I'll be able to do a comparison. Even if I do get that Boba Fett, and let's be honest, we all know I'm going to. One Hasbro does make theirs. I'm still I'm still going to hold on to this guy. This means a lot to me. This the fact that you sent me your custom Boba Fett, a figure that I knew you loved and you worked very hard on. That's a price that that is something that no money no amount of money can buy. No, no matter how expensive. Dude, thank you. Thank you so much. I love him. I do. I really love him. I love him a lot. He is so cool. This is, this will be my Boba Fett for outside shots. I mean, I have been using this Boba Fett too. I have. But, um, now I can, I can get this one like dirty and in the, and like, just, you know, like battle shots and stuff like that. Man. So damn cool. Bro, thank you so much. If you guys want to follow my friend on Instagram, the one who sent me this, give him a follow on Instagram. I am going to leave a link to his in Instagram in the description down below. Man, this is just way too awesome. He, uh, I love him. This is just way too cool, guys. I'm sorry. He, he, look at him. That That is as a screen accurate as possible. You know, without it being an official has 
official licensed Hasbro figure. He did pretty damn good. So now I got both Boba Fett's. One from Empire, one from Jedi. That is friggin' awesome. Bro, thank you so much. This figure means a lot to me. And you know, not only am I going to be taking pictures of him, he will be displayed on my Star Wars shelf with pride. Again, bro, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. This really means a lot to me. Thank you. Thank you. I love him. Can't wait to be taking pictures of him. Alright guys, that was it. Um, thank you very much for tuning in. Oh, before I go, I did very recently find this guy at my Walmart. The Black Series Archive Wave, Anakin Skywalker, and he was the only one there. I'm going back and forth and debating whether or not if I should do a review on him. Please let me know if you want to see a review on him. You know, um, it's just since this is a Star Wars related video, I figure, you know, why, why not bring, a, bring it up? So if you guys want to see me review this guy, please let me know. Man, this Boba, he is just so awesome. I'm really digging him. I'm really digging him. This is awesome. Thank you again, bro. I'm, I'm speechless. I'm just in awe. This is so freaking awesome. Alright, guys. I'm gonna go, because I'm speechless. This means way too much to me. Alright, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Oh! If you want to see me review this guy, this Boba Fett, also please feel free to let me know because I would love to go over the details and get you guys up close and personal with this guy. Because this is pretty freaking screen accurate. So if you want to see me review this guy and the Anakin Skywalker, let me know, please. Alright guys, this is the Proud Nerd. Signing out, and I'm saying to all my fellow nerds and collectors out there, too, stay nerdy. Peace.